put it one o'clock in the Colorful algae bloom in our waters 
and provide sustainable farming while also giving Xandar a beautiful shimmering iridescence. Like Terra, Xandar has an atmosphere that sustains life. The blanket of gases not only contains the air we breathe, but also protects us from the searing heat and radiation emanating from our three stars, or suns. I find it fascinating how similar our two worlds truly are. They both share many wonders. You will discover more of them just ahead. Welcome to the of Xandar. As you have seen, your world and ours were born of the same moment, one which you refer to as the Big Bang. As such, we are all galactic neighbors in a vast universe which we and countless others share. For you to travel to Xandar would take two and a half million years, assuming you had a ship that could fly at the speed of light. So we decided to come to you. But even we could not have reached you so easily were it not for the Cosmic Generator, an advanced piece of Xandarian technology that creates jump points, artificial tunnels that act as shortcuts, linking distant points in space. It is our desire to share this wondrous technology with your people so that together we might explore new worlds and create a brighter tomorrow. And now, as the culmination of the wonders of Xandar, you will be teleported to a Nova ship above your planet for a demonstration of the Cosmic Generator. I trust you will find it an unforgettable experience. Welcome, people of Elka. Citizens of Epcot. Does anyone know what they call themselves? What? I'm on. Someone needs to tell me what I'm on. Welcome, Epcot Terrans. I am Centurion Tau Merrick, and we're just about ready to teleport you up to the ship for the demonstration. As you're about to enter a secure Nova area, I must ask you to put away your Terran communication devices at this time. Recording of any type is strictly prohibited. I am very serious about this. Now, please step forward into the chamber. You're gonna love this. Cosmic Generator. 
Jesus will be activated. So you can experience for yourself what's happening. I'm not sure. Our power is out. And the cosmic generator is gone. Here your monitor. Go to code red. Prepare the fleet. And call the guardians. Now. There is no cause for alarm. Turn off that alarm. I've got an important transmission coming in. Hey, what's up, number four? Our cosmic generator has been stolen. What? How? What did we figure that? That thing's got to be worth a fortune. I am Groot. Yeah, what do you think, Tucky? Perhaps that really big man outside your ship. Well, that is a big man. I need to alert Nova Prime. I am watching Terrans for the dogs. What's on for you? This species has failed. Wait, whoa, whoa, we didn't even know there was a test. He's got a cosmic generator. He's creating a jump point. Jump point to where? Jump point. Let's go back to the dark time. Dark time, why? To erase an error. Well, that doesn't sound good. Your time is over. Wait, whoa, whoa. What do you mean? What do you mean it's so bad? The jump point is closing. Hey, no, you. You're not recording to follow that. That whatever it is until we get there. We can't. Our power is down, and I've got to get these Terrans onto evacuation shows. I got it. I mean, we the shuttles to fall through the jump point. Wait, what? Yes, look, they're our only chance to keep a track of that black job until we get the cosmic generator back. Piece of cake. What? The key. Where's the key? The odds are impossible. Yep. But it's our only shot. Good luck. Are you sure you control it? Come on, it's me. We got this. We're all toast. First was you, now there's toast. Spanish making me so hungry. Haha. <laughs> Terry, listen up. You need to make your way to the back of my 